Pops a dent, dent ending repair kit. Contents include a glue gun, two large long glue sticks, a handle, three different posts with bases, a turning knob, and a plastic pick to help remove any glue. The instructions in a nutshell are heat up your glue gun for five minutes, apply glue to the base that that's that best fits your dent. Let the base and then stick it onto your car in the middle of the dent. Let it set for eight minutes. Then put the base through the hole in the handle, put the turning knob on the other end, and basically just tighten the knob to pull out the dent. For larger dents, you're to position the base like at 12 o'clock, three o'clock, six o'clock, nine o'clock, and pull out the dent multiple times. If you have to reapply the glue and pull it out for extra large dents, you just keep doing it until you get the desired results. I'm heating my glue gun up for five minutes. I actually have a few dents. I have one right here. I've cleaned this area and it's right on the crease. So I'm thinking I'll try to pull right above it and right below the crease. And then I have where like a car hit me, it's actually two small dents here. I don't know if you can see them. So I'm going to do, I'm going to pull here and here. Five minutes, so I'm going to apply glue to the base. And the instructions say make sure you cover all the holes. Now I'm going to apply it to the car right under the crease the first time. Hold it until it will stay by itself. And then we're supposed to let it sit for eight minutes. It's been about eight minutes. I'm going to put my handle on. I'm going to angle it so the pad isn't right on my fender crease. Well, it's not going to work, so I'll do the best I can. And I'm, you screw this on. And you just use your brute force. Twisting and twisting. I don't know if I'll hear a pop or... Okay, it did pop. All right. Take it off. And now we have our little plastic tool here. Basically peel it off. I think it did make an improvement. I'm going to probably have to do it a few more times though. Made a slight improvement. Let me work on this for a while. My dents on my door here, they're literally like totally gone. I'm just pulling them out one more time. It took several tries. There's one thing I want to show you, a little bit scary. I'm going to pull this one off. Make sure you stand aside on the newer cars that have like a composite shell, very flexible. It will actually shoot a few, like several feet away. Let me move all the way. Okay. I just want, it's like a safety warning. Now, the, obviously, the more you can screw it down, the harder it's going to shoot. Now, the several tries is, because it gets better and better each time. And for side dents, you may want to start with the larger pad. It's going to shoot off in a minute. And then switch to the smaller one. About screwed all the way in. Well. And there it is, all the way over in the grass. That's probably about 10, 12 feet. It's getting dark out, but the, these little, I had two dents right here. You cannot feel them at all. They're totally gone. The one over here, it is better, but there's still a slight dent on the crease. The instruction sheet does say it doesn't work on creases. So it did improve the look and I think if I have more time later, I might do a couple more spots, do it a couple more times at top and bottom of the crease, but it did improve it. And on the door in the middle, it's gone. So I hope this is helpful. Thank you.